understanding your test results and monitoring your kidney function. Your test results contain lots of names and figures, and maybe it is easy to tell which statistics are getting better or worse, but not easy to tell what all of this means. If you are clear about what the different measurements mean you are likely to feel much more empowered in regard to improving your health. There are several main parameters that are used to assess kidney function, and we will go through each of these to gain a clear understanding of how they reflect your kidney function. GFR. Perhaps the most important measurement is GFR, glomerular filtration rate or EGFR, estimated glomerular filtration rate. The glomerular are the filtering units of the kidneys. Because the kidney's main function is to filter the blood, if the rate at which filtering occurs is decreased, this is the most reliable sign of diminished kidney function. GFR is a urine test that measures a decrease in kidney function with a drop in rate. The healthy range for GFR is 90 to 125 milliliters per minute for men, and slightly lower for women at 90 to 115. If your test shows a GFR below 90 this is considered as mild kidney damage, or the beginning of kidney disease. Estimated GFR is based on creating in levels and takes into account, sex, age and race. If eGFR decreases to below 10 milliliters per minute, then it is considered that a patient requires dialysis. Natural Tips As GFR is a direct reflection of your kidney function, Anything that you use in regard to natural treatments will assist in increasing your GFR. This includes dietary and lifestyle changes and also herbal and nutritional therapies. There are a wide range of remedies to improve GFR, and for more information on those that would be appropriate for you, please refer to the link on the description below this video. Creating in. Creating in is a product formed by the breakdown of creating phosphate as a result of skeletal muscle metabolism. Creatinine is released at a constant rate into the bloodstream as a result of this process. When kidney function is optimal, serum creatinine remains balanced as it is excreted in the urine at the same rate in which it is produced. The kidneys play a major role in filtering creatinine from the blood, and much of it is passed out in the urine. Creatinine readings work inversely with GFR. So if GFR is low, then creatinine will be high. Therefore high creatinine is regarded as a very reliable indicator of diminished kidney function. The reference range for blood creatinine is 0.6 to 1.2 mg per deciliter in men and 0.5 to 1.1 mg per deciliter in females. In other countries, 45 to 90 micromoles per liter for women and 60 to 110 micromoles per liter for men. In general, vegetarians have lower blood creatinine than meat eaters, and strenuous exercise also increases blood creatinine. There are many natural therapies available. Combined with appropriate dietary and lifestyle changes, you can both reverse kidney damage and protect from further damage to your kidneys in the future. Get an effective step-by-step -step program proven to start healing your kidneys today by Duncan Cappuccino, N.D., a fully qualified naturopath, author, and medical researcher specializing in kidney disease. Take action by clicking the link below. You'd be surprised how well this works. If you're ready to take action, click on the link below this video now.